I'm installing a new floor and I'm going to show how to replace a carpet strip. And this is what I'm going to use. I got it at Home Depot for $11. Carpet trim, 36 inches, hardwood. It's got like a little lip so it goes transitions from the carpet to the vinyl floor. This is a pry bar and a hammer. Now I'm going to remove the nails from the tack strip because I'm going to reuse this part right here. It's going to go right here and when you're measuring it, I cut off a little bit on each end so the screw holes are symmetrical. Okay, it comes with four screws and I'm going to add two screw holes, one on each end. And this is, this is a countersink it's to get this little beveled edge on the inside of the hole. Now I reinstall the carpet tack strip about a quarter of an inch behind where the transition strip's gonna go. Then I use this little carpet kicker. I get this on Harbor Freight for like five or ten dollars or something. It like stretches the carpet. Press it down onto the carpet tack strip nails. Keeps it nice and tight. What I like about this is that sometimes you get like pet damage where a cat will claw the carpet up or something. And this will cover a little bit of the leading edge. And I'm going to paint this white and I'll come back show you the finished product. Here's the final installation. The carpet tack strip is right about there. Here's the remodeled bathroom. New vinyl floor, costs like 200 bucks. New carpet, all new paint. I even painted the cabinet with some hardware. Thanks for watching.